to know the potential of a given flow linear one, it must imagine given as a volume divided by the unit of the space, which advances in a single line in the flow of time. Therefore, the date multiplied by the area one for one, it becomes a volume all placed in a section motionless, not advancing in time. Extracting the square root, you know the potential of one line. Therefore, 1945.0806 indicates the year 1945 and the month 8 and the March 6. From its square root we get the potential linear. Well, 1945.0806 rises to one middle is equal to 44.103180. One eight one two nine one one and so going on. For a result that is significant, we must take the power until the eighth decimal place. So forty four point one zero three one eighty one two nine with the remainder to be deleted after the sum of plus 1 to the last 8 decimal place. So the power is 44.1031813030. This number is a power atomic, divine, and I'll show. In fact, 44 is the unity and the, the trinity of 10 plus 1 equal 11, in 11 was as the unit and 33 as its trinity, and so 11 plus 33 equal 44 is the unit and the trinity of the 10 plus 1 of God acting with the 10 and with the unit of himself. Afterward we have 10 divided 100. 100 is a the absolute area. So a number divided by the absolute area is the unit of the absolute area. 10 divided 100 is so all the cycle in its unit in the unit of the area. 31 divided 100 squared is the trinity of the 10 cycle plus the unit. The division between 100 squared, that is 10 raised to minus 4, reveals the unity and the trinity of God acting with the 10 at the dimension of 10 raised to 1 plus 3, and so, and the unit, and the, tr in the trinity of the 10 base. Afterward, we have 81, that is equal to 3, rise to 1 plus 3, and so 81 is all the power unitary and trinitary, 
of the Trinity of God. Referred to the unit of millions, it is the referring to 10 raised to 3 multiplied by 10 raised to 3, that is to the complex made by 10 raised to 3, the positive and the negative. And so it is referred to the unit of the absolute complex. The last number, 3, referred to the sides of 10 raised to minus 7, indicates the trinity in the unit of the creation. The creation is in 7 days. Here, 10 raised to minus 7 days represent the destruction of the atomic. The potential of death, August 6, 1945, was therefore divine and manifested in the power of the atomic structure, of the construction and the destruction of the divine material world. Now, since uh, my life is emblematic, in that day, the days of my life were all these potentials exist also in my life. My life is truly emblematic. In that time of the atomic, I had exactly 27 hundreds plus 26 units, where 27 is uh, the trinity power of the base of God in its trinity, and uh, 20 7 is the unit in this absolute and it is the 26 that is the number of Yahweh in the Jew Kabbalah while it is the number of Dio about God in the Italian Kabbalah to have a understanding what means in my life the end of the Mayan calendar in December at the end of the 21 of the year 11 of the year 12 I'll have not the 27 hundreds that uh, I had uh, in this time of the atomic, but 27 thousands of day. So, multiplied by 10. And uh, not uh, 26 days, but uh, 26 plus 10, multiplied by 10 days. So the difference between the day of the atomic in my life from the end of the Mayan calendar for me means the atomic explosion in my life, I'll die in the, that day.